there and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to this channel, welcome. Thank you for stopping by. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button down there so you guys can see more videos from me in the future. This is the first official video for 2016 for me and I got a lot of requests for this video so I figured I should start the year off with a requested video and it's the what's in my backpack tag and you guys have probably seen this backpack so many times and you are probably sick of it because I have featured this in my lookbook videos and if you follow me on Instagram I pretty much always carry this wherever I go and um, if you follow my blog you probably have seen this backpack also in my lookbook posts so I figured I might as well share what's inside or what I carry in this backpack of mine pretty much has been my go-to bag lately and that's because like I I just like it. It carries everything and for such a small looking bag, it actually carries a lot of things and you'd be surprised how much stuff I'm going to be pulling out in this backpack. It's pretty heavy. So let's just get started um, peeking inside through my bag. So first off, first thing I'm going to take out um, is this bag of candy. Yes, it's kind of gotten out of hand because I feel like I need to carry a bag of my favorite candies from Lolly and Pops. I actually picked out a variety of other candies that I normally get, but my usual go-to candies are obviously the white chocolate covered gummy bears and the marshmallow bones. So I feel like I have to have a bag of this every time I'm out or else I, you know, yeah, I have a problem. Obviously are my car keys. I got rid of the excess stuff for my car key so it's just the remote and the car key itself. For my house keys, you've seen this in my previous what's in my bag video. I've always had this um, key pouch and inside has my access card and my keys to get inside the house. Next is my notebook. So I'm still pretty old school. I like carrying a notebook with me and this is basically what I have gonna be using for 2016 so basically this is where I jot down my ideas for videos for blog posts and everything else or just things I need to remember so I'm still pretty old school I like writing things down I prefer writing things down than jotting it down on my um, iPhone I actually found my iPhone kind of unreliable sometimes because I found out that um, sometimes it erases certain things but when you write things down at least it's a little bit more permanent until you lose your notebook but uh, you know I still prefer writing it because I feel like I need another notebook. I have another one, this small one right here. And this one is basically my to-do list. Um, I have like, a smaller notebook for my to-do list so I can, whenever I switch purses, it's a little bit easier for me to carry it. And sometimes I just don't bring my other notebook. Um, sometimes I only need this. So I like this one because it has this little garter and it's small enough to fit in most of my purses. Since we're still on the topic of notebooks, I also have a planner. I know you guys are probably thinking this is a little bit ridiculous that I have a planner and two separate notebooks, but I like to keep things organized and that's kind of how I keep myself organized because if I don't, I'm going to completely forget everything and things will just be out of whack. So this is where like I put all my um, appointments or if I have something to do at a certain date, you know, like just important stuff. It goes in the planner and um, I have this pen uh, that I got from Daiso which also has like a stylus uh, tip on the other end so you know for snapchat purposes yeah very handy it writes on regular paper and it writes on your phone so because I like cute things um, I also carry this um, pack of pens that has like 10 different colors. I don't know why, but I'm a lot more motivated to write things down when I have a variety of colorful pens. And this one I actually got on Amazon and I was just looking for cute pens and this came up. I really like how this one writes because the tip of the pen is very thin. I'm not really a fan of this case because the hinge just comes off like very quickly. So I think I'm gonna get a new pencil case for my pens because I just want to carry my cute pens in my backpack or my bag all the time. Okay, so that's pretty much it for my stationary stuff. I still have quite a few items inside this bag. So I cannot forget about my phone. I have 
the iPhone 6 and this one um, and my case is from J Crew. This day and age I feel like you could never leave your house without an external battery because Snapchat just drains your battery. So I have been using this external battery that I got from Amazon and I like it because it's pink and it's cute. The only thing is this is kind of heavy and it does take up some space in my backpack but I just really like it. It's cute so it fits in my backpack, it goes in my backpack. Cannot forget my charger. I need to have my charger. This one is looking all sad and just sad because look at it. It's I don't know why Apple chargers um, get messed up so easily but yes Gotta have my charger because what good is my external battery if my charger is not in my backpack. Next is my vlogging camera and if you guys don't know yet, I have been vlogging with the um, Canon G7X and I actually got this as a birthday present from Heart so I can vlog for you and yeah, it's a lot easier because you can flip the screen and I can see myself. Harry mints, cannot forget about the mints because you never know who's getting too close to your face and you really just don't want to offend anyone. I also carry a small makeup bag with me just to have my essentials and I'm just going to go over it real quick. I have blotting sheets, um, whatever lipstick I'm wearing for the day, lip balm, mirror, and apparently I have another lipstick this one is from bite and lip gloss from julep so i try not to carry more than three lipsticks or lip gloss whatever in my makeup bag because i mean i'm not going to use all three of them so what's the point in carrying them so i only carry whatever i'm wearing that day so it doesn't take up too much space oh and i also have this lip balm right here and this one is from etude house but it has the eos look and i've been really liking this one a lot because it kind of tastes peachy and it looks like a dinosaur egg. I don't know if you guys can see it but it's already kind of fading because I've had it for so long. Okay, we're almost done with this video. Um, I have my wallet and this one is the Louis Vuitton billfold wallet, credit cards and whatnot. And apparently I carry way more receipts than I do with cash so I only have two dollars in this wallet. Last but not the least, because I carry so much junk in my backpack, I also have this um, coin purse from Alexander Wang and I've had this for so long and this is where I mainly put all my change and my gift cards and if I have any rewards card for the store so I have it all handy in this little coin purse. That's pretty much it. Wait, do I have anything in here? Oh, I have stuff in here in this little pocket. Um, I have a dollar and an old key card from when we went to New York. Let's see what else I have in here. In this little pocket. Um, oh, I have a Metro card again from when we went to New York. So that wraps up my what's in my backpack tag. Please don't forget to hit the thumbs up button so I know you guys enjoy this video. Sound off on the comment section down below to let me know what you'd like to see next on this channel. I hope to see you guys on my next video. Until then, I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye!